So just another quick video about a new feature that's been added to the latest version of Virtual DJ, which is built 6017, uh, which is all about getting stored loops from Serato. It's kind of a little bit under the radar maybe because it wasn't really in re release notes, only in early access release. So what's this all about? Well, if I open up Serato, have it here, and I load a track like this one, you can see it already has a cue point that I said previously. Let me just tap it so we go to the right place in the song. And it also has a, uh, a stored loop, which is what this video is all about. So you can see this is actually the stored loop. So uh, that's what has been done in Serato. I don't want to use Serato. So I shut that down. Yes. And I open version DJ. And you can see the same track here. It's an unknown track in Virtual DJ, so it's ready to be read on first load, or you can analyze it, if you will. Uh, but uh, let me just check the options first here. So if I so it's for get, you can see these down here, the tax ones, get text also, get everything. And you can see it's actually set to default. There's no stars out here. And the important one here is get cues from tax. That also covers the loops. So you've been able to get cues from tags for a long time, but the loops part, the stored loops are the new part. So if I now load this track, which is brand new to version DJ, you can actually see up here that I get the cue point and I get the saved loop. So I can just use the cue point instantly, like you would expect, or I can switch down to the saved loops and I can get the saved loop right away like this. So that was just a quick video showing the new uh, feature where you can get the saved loops uh, from Serato when migrating to Visual TG.